Hey everyone, and welcome to EdTech Hustle. In this video, we're going to explore iOS 18, specifically how you can add Face ID to any app on your iPhone. All right, here is my iPhone. You'll notice that I have apps like Venmo, which have bank information. And if this phone somehow gets unlocked and in the wrong hands, someone could open up Venmo and make some unauthorized purchases without me knowing. So what I wanna do is add an extra layer of protection, that being Face ID. So you can do this with iOS 18. So to turn this on, I just have to press down on the app and it's going to give me this menu. What I wanna do is choose this option that says require Face ID. Okay, now from here, you have two different options that will both require your face ID, but I'm just going to choose this one up at the top. We'll talk about hide in another video. So I'm going to tap on require face ID. It sees my face. You'll notice at the top that it saw my face and now it has approved face ID for Venmo. So if I just open Venmo, I'm just gonna kind of move my face out of the picture. There we go, now I can try to open it, but it's going to be looking for my face ID. Now in this case, my face is not in front of my iPhone, so I'm unable to open this app because I added Face ID. Now this just gives you an extra layer of protection because first off, it's probably unlikely that your phone is going to be unlocked pending you have Face ID just to unlock your iPhone, but now you have an additional layer, and that being the ability to add your Face ID to specific apps. Now what happens if maybe you want to turn off Face ID? You're just gonna follow those same steps. We are going to tap on the app. I'm going to choose this option, don't require Face ID. It's going to, again, look for my face. You probably saw that at the top of the screen. And now we are all set. So just a really quick and easy trick if you're interested in adding that extra layer of security by adding your Face ID to any app on your iPhone, just make sure that you have the latest operating system, which happens to be right now, iOS 18. So thank you so much for watching this video. And if you have questions or comments, leave them in the comment area below. Thank you so much and have a great day. Thank you.